Or you send me some footage, some text with uh, the battle rapper Math Hoffa. The battle rapper Math Hoffa is calling me a bozo. Hmm. So uh, the guy said, sir, why would he call you a bozo? He got a girl, his girl, his, her name is Godiva, Godiva, some, she's a battle rapper. I said, yeah, I heard he got a wifey. She said, she airing his ass out. Not the wifey. Not his rose. Huh? This what kind of girls your wife and huh? And I cut out, I cut out everything she said about Drake. Drake was flirting with her. So she was messing with Drake on Math Hoffa. I thought it was all cap, so I left it out. But then when I hear the disaster battle, disaster spills the beans. So the girl herself say, why you mad at Drake? He's not the only guy I was messing with on your ass. Oh, man. Let's listen to a little bit so y'all don't think I'm capping. Check it out. Yeah. Math is the corniest nigga in battle rap. I this is was his, this was his wifey, y'all. This was Math Hoffa's wifey. Come on, man. Hold up, hold this up. Nigga. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Come on, man. Niggas want to play. I'm all for the games, nigga. I be out SOBs. I be outside. I'm all for the games. All for it. Call me a bozo. Any one of you stupid battle rappers got something to say, I'm a ride you niggas. All y'all got on me is me snuffing Fendi in the store, and that's it. I got mad shit on you bozo clowns. This nigga's wifey airing them out. So we're going to be playing that all through the video. And then I got hours of recording of where the girl that me and him was both hitting, he took the condom off. He had venereal warts on his dick. He could have killed all of us. Huh? So he thought he think I'm bluffing with that. I'm going to play a little bit today for his stupid ass. I kept it all these years because I knew you was a stupid black bastard. You are, you are a snake. Hmm? But I'm a serpent with a long memory. I never forget shit. And I always keep bullets in the chamber. Always prepare for war in my times of peace. Because of you dumb black son of a guns. Huh? Why I got to be black on black all the time, man? It's not white man doing this. It's you N-words. So I play. I like it. I'm, I'm all for it. What they say? I'll be a Huckleberry. This is Math Hoffa's wife for a few years. Her name is Godiva. She about to air him out. Check this out. Yeah. Math is the corniest nigga in battle rap. I wish I could take my pussy back because I don't even understand how I got in that situation with such a bitch ass nigga. Like, did he portray himself as such a real nigga? But Hold up. May y'all go see her now. Don't worry. If they flag my shit, I'm going to record this show and put it on uh, Patreon. If I have to put it on Patreon, I'm going to hook it up crazy. Pictures, all types of shit. So hope they block my shit. But check out her name is Bonnie Godiva. Y'all check her out, y'all. This was his wifey for a long time. Check it out. Yeah. Math is the corniest nigga in battle rap. I wish I could take my pussy back because I don't even understand how I got in that situation with such a bitch ass nigga. Like, did he portray himself as such a real nigga? But the moves he be making is so fucking like female. Yes, sir. It's niggas still walking around that whoops your fucking head in ass that oh, put oh, your oh. fade on the floor. No, jump. no, 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 no. We don't, we don't, we don't, we don't skip past that. We don't, let me get the fuck off the screen. We don't skip past that. Check this out. Come on, Bonnie. Email. 
It's niggas still walking around that whoops your fucking head in and hey. that put your fade on the floor, jumped you all the ty- all type of foul shit hit you with inanimate objects. You are Nori telling him, yo, this nigga hit Nori and told him I ate his ass. Who does that? That's not no. Y'all heard that? Come on, man. I ain't saying shit. She's saying it, man. I don't know this woman, man. Come on, man. Stop playing with me, man. This chick's trying to play with me, man. You gonna go up there and tell Nori that this woman ate your ass because you're all punks. Include Nori. That man got up there and said, this other man got up there and said, um, he went to jail and he had sex with a man. All the Eater Booty gang came up there to Nori's house. They all faggots. I said that. My job is to prove to y'all that they all faggots. All of them. Every single one of them false prophet ass niggas. Why would I feel good or, or comfortable telling Nori my girl ate my ass out? Why would I feel comfortable telling Nori that? They all chumps. You think the, the, I'm, I'm, I'm fighting niggas. They tell me out. They call me a struggling podcast. I got Zionists on my neck, you motherfucker. I got these demons on me, man. I'm not riding a wave. Huh? There ain't no punk shit going on over here. So they slow my stuff down and people are being all unsubscribed saying, sub, why you unsubscribe? I ain't do that. Sub, why you block me? I ain't do that. When you talk like I talk, they shut you down. They need these punks to be number one. Now, this man went up there. He felt comfortable telling another man that his girl eats his ass out. Huh? Let's get to it, man. Y'all want nigga shit? Let's play. I'm a bozo. Let's see who's the bozo now. Stupid battle rap clown. Check it out. All, the, this type, all type of foul shit hit you with inanimate objects. You want Nori telling him, yo, this nigga hit Nori and told him I ate his ass. Who does that? That's not normal. Niggas don't like their ass eating. So for you to even say that, nigga, why are you saying that? Did you like it? Because I don't remember that. You must have liked it. Yeah, he liked so it. So when the, when the topic came up of him and rape, is he a dodgy ass nigga? Does he do bitch ass shit? Yes, of course he does. I forgot about the rape allegations. He took a girl out for a smoothie. And he kept saying smoothie. He's an evil genius. Smart motherfucker. Or smart to someone dumb. I see through your evil gay homosexual ways. It's this guy that says all. He raises one one eyebrow and he says outstanding or marvelous or some faggot shit he said. Him and math is the same being. They punks with beards. Hmm? No girl going to ever say I raped her because I play it like a dawn. I pose and get chose, bitch. You're going to be all over me. I'm going to take my time and, and you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna come on in me. Now, sub so ain't didn't. I'm, not, I'm never going to be the aggressor. You're not going to get rap, rape allegations on me. Girls, why would a girl say such a thing? Did you... you you, 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 her clothes is all tore up and all that. Come on, man. You strong on that pussy, man. Just like I'm going to play the, the thing where you slid the condom off on this chick me and you was hitting, Nick. I got the footage. I'm going to play it for your stupid ass. I'm in his mom crib. The nigga live with his mom, ma. That's not. Another nigga live with his mother. Now you go. Now you, you faggot ass niggas. Y'all go around my way and do your homework. Sub Zero out of there. Gonna come up there with this last sub, live with his mom. These niggas live with their mama. Oh, gully TV in the basement in a little room with books and shit. Math Hoffa with his mom. Yeah, he came up now. I don't know what he's doing. Niggas is clowns. Check it out. That's not special. The nigga lived there. He has to bring you there. The smallest nigga I've ever seen would have to be Math Hoffa. <laughs> Man, y'all, y'all didn't hear this shit, yo? Don't tell me you six feet for nothing, nigga. You six feet five for nothing, nigga? Check this out. Huh? Look. Bring you there. The smallest thing I ever seen would have to be Math Hoffa. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, you six foot five for nothing? Come on, man. What the fuck y'all saying out there? These, these are niggas that's playing with me. 
Hey, hey, yeah, hey, hey. Let me see what y'all saying out there, man. I'm going to get to those donations. Please keep donating. Hey, Ishak Muhammad. He got warts, genital warts. And I was trying to get the girl to talk on the phone, but she knew something was up. So she kind of like dumbed it down a little bit. But I got the recordings and I got about hours of that shit. Uh, let's play a little bit so y'all don't think I'm fronting. Let's play a little bit so y'all don't think I'm playing the games. Check it out. Listen up. I can't let him do that. He put that off. I cannot let him do that. I did it. I will not do that. I will not do that to myself. Let alone to you. He slipped the condom off. Check it out. I can't let him do that. He put that off. I cannot let him do that. I did it. I will not do that. I will not do that to myself. Let alone to you. You think what he took that pussy? Cause we gonna file rape charges right now. Oh, my well, every time I say that, it gotta be that. No, no, I'm saying. So, what are you saying? Like, you knew he had some shit on his dick. What do you have on his dick? It looks like what? All right. It looks like what? All right. It looks like what? All right. It looks like what? So, so then, why are you why are you calling my phone, acting like everything's all good? You could have killed me. You knew he had warts on his dick. You let him, you let him fuck you raw. I did like, not let him do that. That was not something that I let him do. That's something that he snuck and did. You could have me. He snuck and took the condom off, and his dick wasn't right. Check it out. Disease. You are right. You right, but listen to this. Something that I let him do. That's something that he snuck and did. You could have gave me a disease. You are right. You right, but you're right. Something that I let him do. That's something that he snuck and did. You could have gave me a disease. You are right. You right, but you're right. You're right. Nobody's saying that you're wrong. You told me that you're, you're, you, that you're trying to make him go to the hospital because he didn't look right down there. That's what you told me. Listen, after I peeped it and we sitting in here. They was talking. She said, I don't know what that is, but you need to go to the hospital. It don't look right down there. Math Hoffa, yo. Come on, Math. Come outside and play, Math. I got hours of this recording, yo. Huh? Once I knew she was a cruddy bitch, I said, oh, let's play. Let me record. Let me record some of this. This is what the battle rap niggas do. Let's play. Stupid nigga. Who's the bozo now? Sub don't slide condoms off on bitches. Bitches beg sub to take the condom off so they can feel it. Not the other way around. You dig? Nasty motherfucker. Huh? What they saying at that? Math is down bad for that. He slid the condom off on, on these whores. I mean, you don't do no shit like that, nigga. I tell you, we all hitting the same bitches at one time. I'm fucking fab, bitch. Fab fucking the bitch. I'm fucking everybody. I'm, but I'm, I'm an old nigga, so I just listen to the pillow talk. Encourage it on, get info on niggas. Wow, these bitches is really talking, man. Wow, they talking about, yeah, yo, everybody fucking the same hoes. Math just bumped into one of my hoes, and he took the condom off. He had warts on his dick. So the, 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 the hoe came clean. She said, I fucked the math the other day. No! Yeah, he slid the condom off. He had warts and shit on his dick. Oh, no. Did you see how skinny this nigga look? Yo, I, you know, every, it's embarrassing to everybody. This sub, that's not a good look for you neither, sub. Yeah, I know. Just got to prove that these niggas is creep, weirdo, bozo niggas. They all going to them bar mitzvah parties playing with those Zionists. And this is what they doing, man. They big homosexuals, man. We're going to play that all through the thing. Let's listen to his girl one more time, and then uh, we'll move on a little bit. Check it out. His, his girl. Yeah. Math is the corniest nigga in battle rap. I wish I could take my pussy back because I don't even understand how I got in that situation with such a bitch ass. This is wifey for years. This is like Rosie airing me out of some shit. I don't mess with the same kind of girls you niggas mess with. <laughs> I'll never go public with the same kind of girls you niggas go with. <laughs> Shit, nigga. Too intelligent for that. Nigga, like, then he portray himself as such a real nigga, but a the bitch. moves he be making is so fucking, like, female. It's ni the nigga shaves his arms. He takes the manly beard off and put the goatee and all this be smooth as a baby's ass. He has no hair on his chest and stomach. You got to assume he got around his butthole too, man. 
Look, look what she says. He goes on Noriega. This is his wife, nigga. What the fuck is y'all niggas talking about, man? This is wife. I'm not saying this shit. Niggas kill me like I'm making this. This is fucking wife saying. It's like Rosie airing me out, nigga. This is his wife. Fuck is wrong with you niggas trying to make it look like I'm doing something. Check it out. Still walking around that whips your fucking head in ass, that put your fade on the floor, jumped you all the ty all type of foul shit hit you with inanimate objects. You on Nori telling him, yo, this nigga hit Nori and told him I ate his ass. Who does that? That's not normal. Niggas don't like their ass eating. So for you to even say that, nigga, why are you saying that? Did you like it? Cause I don't remember that. You must have liked it. So when the, when the topic came up of him and rape, is he a dodgy ass nigga? Does he do bitch ass shit? Yes, of course he does. Yes, he do. I'm in his mom crib. The nigga live with his mom, ma. That's not I special. Know. That's I not know. special. The nigga live there. He has to bring you there. The smallest nigga I ever seen would have to be. No, but this this what I'm saying, y'all. This what I'm saying, y'all, to my Scarberians. The Smurf Isaac Hayes, gay looking motherfucking funny face nigga, Gully TV, said that I'm old and I'm bitter. Because these niggas went on the blow up without me. These niggas is in their mama house. Huh? These niggas is getting their booties ate. These niggas got no hair on their arms. Shave around their booty hole real good. What the fuck am I to be jealous of? Gully TV? You lying scumbag? When I'm out on my shit, I get the bitches, the hoes. It's all over me, son. I don't rap to nothing, nigga. My game is tight. My seduction powers is on tilt. I ain't got to say a word. I've been practicing games since 19, man. Game is tight. She said that math got to say, you know, uh, her, his pickup line to her was, let's battle. She said he's a corny nigga. Yo, check out the whole interview. This is just Chip's. This is just little chips of the interview. She said he comes up to girls and say, yo, let's battle. And then hopefully they say, oh, you're the battle rapper guy that knocked Sirius Jones out. And he said, yeah, yeah, you know, I'll be punching niggas' heads. You know, they front like he a real nigga. And then you get down there and you see the man ass is clean as a baby. So they try to, you know, put a finger, you know, hey, math is all bitch. She's telling you, man. Come on, man. It's act like I'm making this shit up. Check it out. That's not normal. Niggas don't like their ass eating. So for you to even say that, nigga, why are you saying that? Did you like it? Because I don't remember that. You might as that put your fade on the floor, jumped you all the ty all type of foul shit hit you with inanimate objects. The um the exhibit nigga ain't hit him clean. This disaster nigga ain't hit him clean. He hit him, but it was more with some stupid shit. He didn't knock his fucking you supposed to hit him in his jaw and fracture his neck some kind of way. He's supposed to be having a stiff neck all month. Huh? If he don't go out. He didn't hit him clean, man. Look at this shit, y'all. He didn't hit him clean, motherfucker. Fuck that money up. Check oh. it out. This nigga still walking around that whoops your fucking head in ass. That put your fade on the floor. Jumped you all the... Ty all type of foul shit hit you with inanimate objects. You on Nori telling him, yo, this nigga hit Nori and told him I ate his ass. Who does that? Kept missing, 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 missing. Missing, think of fucking hold that nigga head with the back of your hand and, and catch that shit, nigga. Big stupid for nothing, nigga. His girl gonna tell you, check it out. That's not normal. Niggas don't like their ass eating. So for you to even say that, nigga, why are you saying that? Did you like it? Because I don't remember that. You must have liked it. So when the, when the topic came up of him and rape, is he a dodgy ass nigga? Does he do bitch ass shit? Yes, yes of course he, he does. does. Yeah, hell yeah. I'm in his mom crib. The nigga live with his mom, ma. That's not special. That's not special. The nigga live there. He has to bring you there. The smallest nigga I ever seen would have to be Math Hoffa. <laughs> <laughs> Six foot five nigga. So bitches say, oh, he got big hands. Oh, he got big feet. Big six foot five for nothing ass nigga. Clown, another Shaq Diesel ass nigga. <laughs> Stupid motherfucker. Who's the bozo now? Your wife aired you out. Your choice of woman, nigga. Shitting on them. So I got the recording. I got about two hours. You know, I'm telling the girl, but why would you make him? Why would you? You seen the warts. 
you know, I'm going on and she's stupid. She's talking all over the phone. I recorded that. I sat on that. I said, one day this nigga going to fuck with me. Here he go. He got a few drinks. He called me out. He's sorry now. He's sorry now. Y'all make sure y'all rip this. Gambion, make sure y'all rip this and get it out there. Huh? She was loving it while she was there, though. Yeah, but then Drake took her. You don't, you don't understand Charlie Hustle. This is what happens. You fucking with these niggas thinking you're about to get on. Charlie Hustle, this is what I was talking about yesterday. Some people like you because you got money. Some people like you because of you. When it comes to these rap niggas, the bitches don't like these corny niggas. They trying to live a fantasy that love and hip hop is selling. They, 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 they tell the girls, yo, what are you fucking with that Sub-Zero nigga for? That nigga ain't nobody, he broke. So let's, let's, let me explain to you what somebody is if I'm nobody. Somebody is who the Jewish people at Universal Records or Revolt is looking at. Now you're somebody. You don't have no power. You can't bring me on the show. You have no power. You're just a puppet. And you're there because you like to fight and design to see something's wrong with you. So you fit the criteria of a dumb black bitch with a blonde wig. We're going to get some good show out of this one. We're going to get a good show out of that. That's a hothead right there. Look at yeah, She wilds out. She gets drunk. She has a missing tooth. She tattooed her boyfriend on the face. A real jackass. So this is somebody who's somebody. Everything is backwards here, y'all. I was talking to my little homie today. He said, yo, man, you see them other podcasters is falling off, right? They no longer obeying God. I said, what you mean, man? He said, you know, they got houses. They, they, they blowing up. But now they trying to keep their fortune. So they trying to appease the Jews who run this shit now. So God taketh away. For what if a man that gaineth the whole world, but loseth his soul, loseth, loseth his soul, y'all? How about that? Sub-Zero don't give a fuck if I lose my channel. My motherfucking, my motherfucking lesson is to tell you when the demon take it from you, start a new one tomorrow. The goal is to make yourself so hot like Charleston White, that anything you touch turns to a few thousand dollars. They won't let Charleston White have a, 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 a YouTube, but he's all over YouTube. I want him on my show, I sure do. Huh? That's power. Screw this demon and his, his control. We don't bow down to him. We bow down to the real God. The Allah, the Jehovah's of the world, the real God. Suck ass niggas. You see this dude? Guilty Knight said, sheesh. What y'all saying out there, man? Huh? I got the girl. I, I didn't want to do this. Fuck, fuck everybody, man. This is Mav Hoffa. This was one of the girls we was both hitting. I gave her a courtesy call. Check it out. He slipped the condom off, y'all. Check it out. Hold on, hold on. Homeboy says something nice. You get Charleston White on your show, sub, and you definitely will get a million views for real, for real. You see that? <clears throat> Dakota Hicks, you see what you just said? So that man is powerful. The Zionists took him off YouTube, and now you telling me if I get him on my show, I will have millions of viewers. That's real power. He said, fuck that demon. I'm going to say what I want to say. You don't alter your channel and tweak shit to please the fucking devil. Fuck this demon. Now he flips on Puffy and all the black, uh, all the God's chosen people who turned their back on God. 
Now the devil's turning their back on them. Puffy's losing money. R. Kelly's doing real time. Huh? Lord knows what the other one did. Uh, the one that shot Megan in the foot. Huh? Everybody's falling from glory. Because you worship a demon. Cocksuckers. Let me do this all uh, thing. We're we going to get back to Mav Hoffa. He wanted to play with me. Who's the bozo now? Which one of you stupid battle rappers is next? Which one of you stupid motherfuckers is next? Stupid bastards. Gully TV got on a rainbow knitted hat and scarf looking like a gay genie. Somebody just sent me that footage. He talk about he's a fruit bowl. Or he come from a land where the fruit is colorful. He's a tropical person. He basically called himself a rainbow faggot. And he says it with such, such sass. And he got this little gay smile where, you know, everything's sweet, you know. It's a faggot and all this glory. Sweet ass nigga. <clears throat> Shout out to Charlie Fields. He said, let's get it, big homie. Let's get it, big homie. <laughs> Scarberians for life. I could never forget what you did for me, General. Thank you, man. I didn't bow down to Satan, so his minions is trying to make me look like a fool. But my God made their God. Huh? My God blessed me. There's nothing your God can do. You can't do the blue high ER on me. I fight back, nigga. I look at every curse as some kind of blessing. Look at me. Y'all get to see my personality. And I get to expose another homosexual playing, acting like a man, spreading genital, genital warts. Bitches is growing mushrooms on their pussies, fucking with niggas like him. Sliding condoms off, sneaky snake motherfucker. And he big. So when the girls realize the condom off, they kind of scared of him. Huh? So he ripping bitches clothes up. Look at it, y'all. Just Google Mav Hoffa rapes allegations. He's just going to keep saying, I took her to get a smoothie. I took her to get a smoothie. Shout out to Lance Quartermain, the house of pain. pain, 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 pain. Sub, the math ain't math thing. Scarberian salute. When one of these punk ass homosexual paper gay ass rappers with their fake teeth and stupid looking ass you shit on them they not even men there's nothing manly about them they're not men you know who the man is the big doofy stupid ass security guards walking with them those are the men big stupid ass niggas shout out to Hannibal man with a with a great strong name and I'm not taking up for math at all. Okay, so you must have said something. Oh, no, he didn't say nothing. Shout out to Hannibal, one of the strongest names. Strongest names. Okay, women always say their ex is corny. What does that say about her? Men don't take these type of women's words seriously. Her word hold no weight at all. Wow, you think so? What about the second girl that said he slid the condom off? Hey, Hannibal, none of my girlfriends would do that about me. Hey, Hannibal, I bet you my life, none of those girls, none of my ex-girls would do that about me. Huh? What kind of girl are we dealing with, Hannibal? Me and Rose have a bad breakup right now. She walk in and catch me uh, up in some whatever, whatever. You ain't going to see her online airing me out. I don't deal with those type of women. We go to the strip parties with them and we, we, we finesse niggas and, and, and we get on the camera shaking that ass. No, I don't wipe shit like that. Huh? So why wouldn't I believe her? What about the second girl? She said he slid the condom off. Looked like he had genital warts. We arguing when I put the whole... I'm waiting for math to rebuttal and then I'm going to put the whole two-hour thing out. Um, the whole argument is he could have killed all of us. Don't you see? 
And I was so powerful, I could have made the bitch call the police on him. He knew he wasn't right. I, I hate the police, though. Shout out to Goonbaya. Goonbaya! See, I'm here, General Submarine, for real. Hey, you get a load of these dudes? Uh, yo, check this out. Now, Goonbaya. Check this out, Goonbaya. You see what I'm saying about these guys? Yo, Hannibal, I appreciate your donation. You just heard this fucking woman say he got up on fucking drink champs, Noriega. So you Google the show and you find where he said that girl licked his ass. Huh? It's there. Don't fuck around and talking about don't take her word for it. He said it out his mouth, man. God damn, I should have had that shit up here ready, cock, so you could see shit like that. We always ready to defend these fucking faggots. He said it out his mouth on Norrie's drink champs. Dig it up. Act like she making this shit up. She said, Google, Google Mav Hoffa, this is Bonnie Godiva. He's shitting all over, all over the internet. Why wouldn't we believe her? You see this shit, Roosevelt, man? Now we're not supposed to believe the girl, and he said it on Drink Champ. So when we find that footage, then what? Oh, well, then we, could, we can't believe the other half. Yo, we are something else. We always trying to make excuses for our rap stars. And half of them is all faggots. Down to the, the bell-bottom pants and rainbow everything. Down to the little bracelets. They ain't got a muscle in their body. They all bitches. Time to break this shit up and restore order. Some kind of eclipse happening where this devil know he's cleaning up house. He's closing in on Puffy. All Everybody getting shut down. People like me are getting empowered to talk like this. Uh, uh, Kanye West, Kyrie Irving, everybody busting out this shell. We got to clean this shit up, man. Now, now we're not supposed to believe her now. She said it's on Drink Champs. It's on Drink Champs. <clears throat> Let's move on, y'all. Fuck this nigga, man. But look at him. This is what he look like. Check him out. Check him out, y'all. This is what we're dealing with right here. This nigga. What kind of nigga is this? What kind of nigga is this? A rotten soul. What kind of nigga is this, man? I am Sub Zero. Yo, let's do this cash app real fast, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, <clears throat> yo, shout out to Ishak. Ishak. He said, for keep going thump, keep going thump, keep going thump. K Slay. Shout out to Russell Ingram and them. You dig? Shout out to Russell Ingram and them. You dig? Shout out to him. He said the black man is God. They playing with a fearless motherfucker who believes he's Batman. So he ain't gonna lose. He always got a hand grenade under the utility belt for a nigga's dumb, stupid ass. Blow your ass apart, nigga. Dumb, dumb. He said, go for a... a, a the Hannibal, the great name, said, both are goofies, bro. Again, I'm not defending him, but she's a goofy for dealing with him for that many years. Then when she don't get her way, now she wants to expose. Okay, uh, Hannibal, you got to look at her interview. Then you got to look at the disaster battle, but disaster tells it all. She slid off with Drake. She says in this interview that I just played, Drake wasn't the only one she slid off with. She had another nigga on the side. You know, women empowerment, they want to be men now. They players now. Huh? So she believes it sound cool? Not my girl. Math girl. She slid out. She said, I, you know, so, so she said, I got an email where you made the diss song to Drake. 
He said, why you keep why you keep picking on Drake? He wasn't the only one I slid out on you with. Look at the interview, Hannibal. She was sliding on them because women are the new players now. They empowered like men. Look at the Barbie movie, y'all. Look at the Barbie movie. Hey, fellas, this is Sub-Zero telling y'all this. Check out the Barbie movie. You ain't watching no shit like that. It's all pink. Woo, the storyline on that is deep. You're going to know that this Zionist demon knows exactly what he's doing. Why black women are jerking their heads away and acting stupid. Why Mav Hoffa's girl thought it was cool to have Drake and a, and a slide off on the side. That Barbie world is something crazy, y'all. I watched it. Watch the movie Barbie with your third eye. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey Hannibal, it couldn't be none of my girls. None of my girls wouldn't do that. That's why I don't fuck with these. I don't, what? Yeah, boy. Huh? Say what you want to say. You couldn't do that to my girl. And y'all record this. Messing with these fucking girls. They expose his dumb ass. Huh? And then he slides off the condom. We'll get back to that. We'll get back to that. Let's, let's, let's go on. Let's teach something, y'all. Mav Hoff is a bozo. Which one of you stupid battle rappers is next? Let's play. Stupid niggas. All right. Let's get to business now, man. Stupid ass, dumb young motherfuckers. Y'all playing with an old vet whose head is clear. I don't, I don't do drugs. I'm not a faggot. I don't have no pressure from a Jew on my neck. Y'all fucking with a real one, son. I'm with it. And I'm brave as a motherfucker. We'll play. We'll see how things play out. All right, I got to freestyle it for a minute. This is deep, y'all. Check this out. I am Stop Zero. Police raid today wasn't for Diddy. It was to destroy the criminating stuff on the powerful men. Sub-Zero wins. We thinking they raiding the house for Puffy. They knew where Puffy was. It's like the old Alpo rooftop tape. Somebody just remind me. When Alpo got knocked off, the first thing I said was, yo, where the tape's at? 